Hi strangers, it's Saturday, January 8th, and we are in the new year. I didn't get to see you guys right after Christmas because the camera sort of lost battery and I have like no idea where the charger is, but luckily I'm using my new computer and hopefully you can see that the quality is much better than the webcam and that um, this new year for New Year's I got my hair done so that it looks different and it looks nice, I think, and um, that's one thing. Well, that's leading me into what I was going to talk about on this video, which is New Year's resolutions, because I make quite a few every year, and there are only a couple that I actually keep up with. Um, one New Year's res resolution that I made for this year is to take better care of myself, because, like last year, I didn't get a lot of sleep, um, crazy all the time, because I didn't eat well and eat right, and I plan to do all of that, take care of myself, you know, like, treat myself, um to things a lot because I feel like I should do that more and I'm gonna lose weight um, mostly for to get healthy because you know I during the summer I love exercising and exercising and during the year I don't get a real chance to do that a lot so I'm gonna try and do that more um, I'm gonna read more and that's another you know thing that I'm that's really important to me because I feel like I read the same stuff so I'm gonna start reading some some more things. Um, I actually got The Hunger Games, which Way has, you know, kind of made me want to read. And when she was talking about The Hunger Games, I could really, you know, understand what she's talking about. Because a lot of times when there's a, a girl narrator, they tend to be a little whiny, kind of. Um, and it's not always, like, actual whining, but it's just, like, the tone that they have, it's just sort of not really original and not really representative of girls everywhere. <laughs> so you know, way you should write a book that, you know, just tears all that, all the, all that down and has a female narrator that people can actually, you know, relate to and think that's pretty cool. So, yeah. Um, I would love to show you guys, like, the whole bulk of my room, but it's not all clean. Like, over there on my bed, as you can see, there's a, a mountain of stuff over there. And, like, um, you know, I'm gonna clean that up because I've just did my laundry, so basically I have clothes over there now. But, um, I did a lot of different stuff in my room, um, over the holidays because I wanted to do something else with my walls and sort of put something else up there. I felt like the wall that was, you know, completely devoted to Taylor Lautner was, although it was enjoyable to look at, you know, it's not really practical. And I'm actually gonna probably put some writing up there, posters, other posters over there. I have some diversity in my room because I feel like um, you know, it's time to start thinking about, you know, real people that I might like to go out with, because the chances of me going out with Taylor Lautner are not good, so that's just something. And I wanted to show you guys what I got for Christmas, because I didn't get a chance to tell you guys around the Christmas time, and, you know, we had the whole week off with the videos and everything. So, um, I'm going to show you guys what I got for Christmas now. Okay, so ignore the blow-up mattress because I had people over. I got this stool, which I like. Um, I got this record player, which is so nice. It plays records and CDs and radio, and I can hook it up to my iPod. I got this Resident Evil Trilogy DVD, which I'm going to have such a good time watching constantly. Um, I got the Harry Potter series. That's only a couple of the books. I don't know where I sat the other ones, but I'll find them eventually. And then, um, I got a lot of DSTBA CDs. I got Painfully Mainstream, This Is Me, This Machine Pones Noobs, Taking Leave, Lowercase by All Caps, and Taking Back the Covers, which is, you know, a various artist CD. And that was basically what I got for Christmas, um, besides the iPad, and I show you, showed you guys that already. Sorry, you guys have to look at Kesha while I turn the camera back around. Um, so, I, I had a really good Christmas. I had a really good holiday. I hope that you guys do. I hope I get school now, which, you know, hmm, it's never all, all too fun. But I had a really good break, and I hope that you guys did too. Um, Grant's theme for the black and white, I would love to do, like, right now, but I have still have homework to do. 
So I will tackle that next week with everybody else, and that'll be really fun. And one of these days, I'm going to have to show you guys how to make my Christmas lemon pie, because I didn't get a chance to do it back with my other Christmas video either. But expect to see it in one of these videos. I'm going to show you guys how to make it, because it's really good, and I think you guys would enjoy it. So I will quit rambling now and let you guys get back to your lives, and I will see you guys within the rest of the week. CFTBA.